Hello everyone, John back with you, j and Music. Today we're looking at the ESP LTD Kirk Hammett 602. Their version here. Um, like I say, great, great metal guitar as anybody would probably tell you. Floyd Rose, uh, it's got the active EMG pickups. Um, two volumes, one tone the three-way blade switch uh, and of course he's got his skull and crossbones uh, what it's kind of famous for here uh, as far as on his fingerboard the inlays and of course there we have the Kurt Hammett uh, signature uh, at the top it does have the reverse headstock uh, like I say if anybody's uh, seen any of my other videos on uh, reviews and uh, just kind of looking at the other guitars uh, reverse headstocks are one of the, one of my favorite uh, features that I have that I like um, in guitars uh, just a few things to go over about it um, it retails uh, for right about a thousand um, that these are um, I think some places you can get for around eight ninety nine so um, like I say if you're going to want to add a case it does not uh, come with a case, but uh, right, right around $900 or so uh, for the guitar only. Uh, it is a neck through body um, as far as the neck itself is uh, a maple, it's three piece neck with an alder body so the sides are alder. Um, it does have a very thin u-shaped uh, neck uh, for this, very fast playing of course if, if Anybody's a Metallica fan, uh, Kurt Hammett fan, they'll know uh, just how well he can uh, go ahead and play that at fretboard as fast as he can uh, with the songs and the solos. Rosewood fretboard, um, uh, 42 millimeters uh, at the nut, 24 extra jumbo frets, and then with the uh, EMG uh, active pickups, it's 81 in the bridge, 60 in the neck. Uh, it is a Floyd Rose, but it's a 1000 series uh, Floyd Rose, of course, double locking uh, system, ESP branded tuners, and like I say, two volumes, one tone, uh, three way switch with a skull and bones inlay. But like I say, that's a Floyd Rose uh, 1000 series uh, that it comes with. Uh, like I say, I've seen a few in white. Uh, this particular one is, of course, in that uh, jet black. Uh, the next thing we'll look at, we'll go ahead and take a, a side view of it. Here on the side view, you can see that nice uh, deep belly cut uh, that it has, of course, getting thicker at the top horn. Uh, but there again, seeing the uh, dot inlays against the rosewood fretboard. Um, like I say being a what they're calling an ultra thin uh, neck so it is a it is very thin profiled neck and then going up to the headstock looking at the top as far as the locking nut and then looking at the angle there of their uh, reverse headstock uh, like I said those are ESP branded uh, tuners but uh, neck through one piece neck no no scarf joints or anything like that with this model so it is all uh, one neck uh, one piece on that neck uh, next we'll go ahead and uh, we'll take a look at the back view all right here on the back uh, we can go ahead and see uh, like I say the compartments there you got your battery compartment uh, the back side of the floor tremolo and the control compartment and of course ESP puts on there is that it is uh, inspected uh, in the USA uh, we'll see up here at the top here in a minute that it is actually made in Korea so like I say you're spending almost a thousand dollars for a guitar that is made uh, in Korea it would be made uh, by the uh, the world instrument um, same people that makes uh, Epiphones um, for Gibson, the same folks that make uh, the Schecter models, especially the Sinister Gates. Uh, it's one of the other videos uh, that I have reviewing that. 
Um, they also do uh, the PRS's for Paul Reed Smith, his line. So um, there is also the neck through. Uh, as you can see, like I said, it's real, real nice and contoured uh, coming through there. So uh, real easy to get up to the higher frets on a 24 fret. There again, seeing that uh, gloss finish on this. Um, some uh, some folks may like the satin finish on the back of their necks because sometimes to me the gloss finish uh, can slow you down a little bit even though it like I said claims to have the ultra thin neck sometimes the finish can actually um, cause you to you know lose some of your speed but it is made uh, in Korea there's the ESP branded tuners There we go, there's that nice belly contour cut out. It's a very comfortable guitar. Um, like I say, it's not uh, super heavy either with the alder body uh, and the maple neck, three piece neck that's all the way through. Uh, the next thing